Right guys, thanks for clicking on the video. I've actually just finished up a little bit of cardio. I did a few rounds on the assault bike. It's actually the end of the day now, but we're still gonna get the video up. Pretty much been working most of the day. Um, and in the title of the video, we've kind of announced another partnership with Future Kids. And I also just wanted to show you the video that Davis put together as well. So that's gonna be at the end of this video. It's gonna be a short one, I'll warn you. It was just kind of, I wanted more just to kind of document sort of what we've been doing with future kids over the past week or so. I mentioned that we are getting schools in Boston and Denver currently and pretty much we've got like, it's probably like five schools in Boston now and it's like three in Denver, but we have a bunch of meetings set up um, with, you know, a lot more schools in those um cities that want to hear about the program so it's really quite exciting and something that's new to us and kind of new that we're going through so i just wanted to put it on camera and kind of talk about where we where we are with it kind of just learning been talking to schools through email and phone call pretty much all this week in different places and right now we are in omaha nebraska and we're just talking to people that are in totally different states and they like what we do and they want to get some football programs with us so yeah it's just really interesting and cool and I just wanted to share it with the camera and we'll, we'll keep it on YouTube and we'll maybe look back and see where we where we were going at this time and yeah it's just gonna be something cool to document so that's kind of what we've been doing um, and we'll continue to do um, what is it? This is the 31st of January, so tomorrow's going to be February. Um, I think it's going to be at some point this month we're going to go to Denver and meet with some of those school programmes and we have sort of a big meeting with a number of schools within one company um, down there. We're trying to figure out the exact date this month that we're going to go down there, but that's going to be awesome. And then it's going to be, I think, early March is when we're going to... Um, well, I hope early March uh, we're going to go to Boston and meet with a lot of the schools that we've been talking to up there with a view to these football programmes starting in this coming April and then pretty much leading into the summer and beyond. So yeah, that's pretty cool and this video that I'm about to roll right now is with um, a company that we've recently partnered with here in Omaha, they are the Omaha Physical Therapy Institute. Um, really awesome, awesome people, great physical therapists, got a couple of locations here in Omaha. I had a recent conversation with them about kind of joining forces and working on some things and they've really helped us a lot so far and we um, sort of partnered with them on a co-branded little piece of content and Davis went over and made this cool video that I'm about to play and you know I'm hoping that we can bring bring some value to people that believe in what we are doing and just all sort of help each other so i'll roll this video right now um from omaha physical therapy institute and future kids if you've watched the video so far give it a thumbs up we've got some travel vlogs coming up soon as well so yeah Catch you next My name is Katie Cordery. I'm a physical therapist here at Omaha Physical Therapy Institute. And uh, my husband Brent and I, he's also a PT here, started Omaha Physical Therapy Institute 13 years ago in order to provide top quality uh, physical therapy services to the Omaha area. Uh, we provide one-on-one -on -one care with the same PT every single visit um, in an encouraging and positive environment. We have our location here at 144th and Dodge and then we also have a satellite clinic inside the Omaha Sports Complex on 147th and Giles. You know when we met with Graham uh, we were really excited to hear that there's an organization out there that's helping the underserved, underserved population um, have access to a sport both my wife and I love, which is soccer. And uh, we both played it our whole lives and we know how important it was to us and that what it offered us with um, not only the, the physical side of things, but being a physical therapist is a, is a big thing, um, but the, the, the camaraderie, the teamwork, the working with coaches and Graham and future kids allowing uh, uh, local area residents to have that opportunity is, is fantastic and we want it to be on board. 